Hi guys, my name is Sheikh Chan Basha and you can simply call me Chanu and today topic is marginal costing and advantages of marginal costing. So before gonna explain uh, about two things, I'll let you know what is the uh, definition of marginal costing now. So marginal costing is the additional cost incurred for the production of an additional unit of output. So the formula is calculated like this way dividing the change in total cost by change in product output so here you're gonna look at the slideshow once so marginal cost is also called incremental cost and incremental cost is the increase in total cost resulting from increasing the level of output by one unit so marginal cost equal to change in total cost by change in output since some total costs are fixed which do not change as the level of output changes marginal cost also equal to increase in variable cost so the result when output increased by one unit so i will tell you what is the example of marginal cost and uh, see what is the formula for marginal cost marginal cost formula is a change in total cost by change in output uh, you know very well what is fixed cost and variable cost if you know what is fixed cost if you know what is variable cost then it is easy for you in my previous uh, lectures i told you what is fixed cost and variable cost so if you want to see then uh, refer my videos once and uh, i provided you one basic example here you can check out what is that so a production line currently creates 10,000 widgets at cost of $30,000 so that the average cost per unit is $3. How it comes? It is 30,000 by 10,000. So total cost by number of units is 10,000. It is $3 and cost per unit is $3. However, if the production line creates 10,001 units, uh, suppose if you want to increase one unit, so the total cost will be changed. That is $30,002. So the marginal cost of uh, one additional unit is only two dollars so if additional unit is uh, increased to two dollars if uh, one unit increases the additional cost is also increased so that is variable cost so a marginal cost is an item it's a variable cost so marginal production cost of an item is the sum of uh, direct material cost direct labor cost direct expenses and variable production overhead cost so the volume of production and the sales increases total variable cost rise proportionately so marginal cost also called variable cost marginal cost equal to direct material direct labor direct expenses plus variable overheads so these are all variable costs fixed cost in contrast are costs that remain unchanged in total period regardless of the volume of production and sales so note that variable cost those which are changed as output changes these are treated as marginal costing as cost of the product fixed costs in the system are treated as cost of period so fixed costs are period cost and marginal costs are as a it is a, a marginal costing as a cost of products let's see what are the advantages of marginal costing so what are the importance and the advantages of marginal costing now uh, marginal costing is uh, important in cost control and decision making and uh, cost ascertainment so these areas cost uh, marginal costing is important and uh, you cannot look at uh, some of the decision making problems that can be solved by the marginal costing are profit planning price uh, pricing of products make or buy decisions product mix etc so i'll tell you one by one in coming classes and uh, thank you very much for watching our videos and if you want to see uh, more videos do not uh, forget to subscribe our channel and like our videos and share our videos thank you so much guys